y'all thank you so much for stopping in um welcome to my channel if you're new here hi thank you so much for stopping by um i hope you do enjoy um the videos that i do post or put out um, this is how i actually done the video and i wanted to come and give you guys a smidge of an update i was actually you know like recording videos and whatnot but then for some strange reason i just stopped because it was a headache trying to edit the videos and then i ran out of space on my phone so yeah that's why i haven't really been doing videos like i should and i was recording like practically every day trying to get stuff together so that i can you know put stuff out for y'all but it just didn't work out the way that i wanted to so yeah um, so, I'm gonna give you guys just a minute, minute of an update, just like I said before. Um, hopefully, um, it kind of explains a lot. But, um, yeah, so, I don't know if I even put the video out, but I did get a new position in my job. So, I went from, okay, when I started, I was PRN. I went from PRN to part time, so now I am full time. But I work in outpatient which I do, I love working in outpatient so much better than working like in the ER because it is a headache working in the ER. Okay, the people that I work with, I love um, the crew that I had, which I was working the weekend, so I was with the weekend crew. And um, the people I work with, they were like amazing. But um, it's just me in ER in general, I was not a fan of, so I ended up just um, taking a new position. It was an outpatient, outpatient, which I do like a whole lot better than working ER. Um, but I think the only down part about this is that I don't necessarily work my full shift because it depends on how many patients we have. And once we're done with our patients, we're done for the day. And I kind of hate that I'm not getting all of my hours, but it is still you know pretty good so i can't complain about that so um i was off today because um one of the girls that were prn she needed some days so i ended up giving her today so i have today off but then i have to work tomorrow thursday and friday so yeah <laughs> i think like three weeks ago I ended up getting a wholesale order for my candy bars. And I was so freaking excited about, you know, getting a wholesale order. I went out, I got like all the stuff that I needed and I started putting all the stuff together. And I um I got the order on a Thursday and then I shipped it out on a Monday. Those today, well, it was like right after when I got off, I went um, and shipped everything out because of course you know you can go to UPS or FedEx on the weekend. So I just waited some money and you know shipped them out. Luckily, they were in the same state as me, but they're just like in a different um, city. So it only took like 24 hours for them to get the package or whatever. So um, I was you know happy about that. But then, like a couple, like two weeks later, I ended up getting the review, and I was like so excited. I'm like, okay, well, what's this person gonna say? Blah blah. blah. Like me two stars out of five and let me tell y'all why she said the reason why she gave me two stars out of five is because for one the packaging was just plain and we're getting ready to do packaging so my old packaging is you know um what i had so i went ahead and put it in the old packaging but she did say that the candy was amazing like it is so freaking good and um she also said that she was surprised at how well everything was packaged and how, you know, the chocolate came and it wasn't melted. Everything was, you know, intact. So, um, she gave me praise on that. It's so freaking hurt because that in itself would, you know, kind of mess me up because if anybody else wants to purchase anything from me, they're going to see, well, she got two stars. So, you know, her stuff isn't that good, so they're gonna bypass me. That's hurting my business. <laughs> like, it's, it's literally hurting my business. 
but any and everybody that has ever tried my my chocolate or my candy or whatever they know that my stuff is good so i mean you're you're hurting me in that aspect my doing is just um changing like my whole packaging thing all together i don't know what i want to do like boxes you know like the little individual boxes but i do want everybody to see what they're getting in the package so if i do get boxes i want them to have like the um window so that you can actually see the candy bar in there so um i'm thinking about doing that uh and i'm also trying to see if i can find um a company that i can get like custom made boxes because like that would like really really help me out a lot because i know they're going to be expensive but if i want this to be done right and i don't want anybody talking trash about my um my packaging then of course i need to you know step it up a little bit but other than that i mean i haven't gotten any more orders that might be because of the two stars that this lady gave me or i don't know but um yeah that was like a bummer um also my birthday is coming up in like a week and a half <laughs> i typically don't do anything for my birthday because like i just i don't know like i have like high hopes to do something like really really fun for my birthday but then um when it comes to like the money aspect something always pops up and so then i'm not able to actually enjoy my birthday so um I'm really not expecting to go anywhere and do anything for my birthday because, like I said, I typically don't. But I did decide to buy myself something because it's something that I wanted. And um, this is the iPad, I think this is the Air that I, well, actually this was my mom and then she ended up giving it to me because she, she never really used it. And it was just sitting. It was just sitting. It just regular. Oh, well, nope, it's just a regular iPad. But this is it. It was just sitting and she wasn't using it. And it's, I think it's like the second generation, if I'm not mistaken. But this is really, really old and it's slow. And um, it takes it forever to do any and everything. But it does still work. It's just really, really slow. So. Um, since I work, um, practically like, um, five days a week, I decided to treat myself and buy, well, I'll put this in backwards, and buy something for myself. And I ended up getting it yesterday. I did a little box, I mean, like, unboxing thing yesterday, but the, um, video looks terrible, so... Um, yeah, I'm gonna get myself the iPad Air. This is the fifth. There we go. Oh, this probably looks a little better. <laughs> this is the fifth generation, so this is the newest one. As you see, okay. the fifth generation. So, um, and I got it in space gray. So freaking pretty i'm already in love with this thing i haven't even like really put everything the way that i need to but um yeah i still have a lot that needs to be done with this but as you can see i'm trying to put everything together and i'm trying to make it look the way i wanted to but i ordered a um case for it a protective glass thing and I also order a pencil so I just thought should be coming Saturday so once I get all this stuff put together this one I'm going to be using for my business um and I should just like to keep track of a lot of stuff because I write stuff down like in a journal well not like a journal like a notebook but I want to have it on my iPad so that's why I went ahead and got the pencil. So I'm gonna be using that. I'm super, super excited to be able to use it for that. Um, and I'm trying to decide which um, domain I'm gonna use. Do I wanna use um, Squarespace or do I wanna use um, 
going at it. So I'm still torn between those two. Um, at first, I was using Etsy. You know, Etsy has this little thing where they can, where you can sell your stuff on Etsy, but you can also have like a little website. And it's just like if you put anything new on Etsy site, it'll automatically transfer over to your uh, website that's on Etsy, which I thought was really, really cool. I think it's like fifteen dollars for that, and then of course you have to pay for you know the stuff, um, your postings on Etsy. So um, I'm kind of torn whether or not I should just keep that, or should I just branch off and just do my own thing with Squarespace or we'll go that so I'm kind of fluctuating between the two because um, I'm gonna go ahead and have my website up um so I'm debating on which one I want to go with so hopefully I can make a decision soon until I can go ahead and get this stuff um up and running because I do have like a lot of people that's been asking for like candy bars and stuff but they are only doing it like because they have like bought something previous and um you know they want to order some more so and also when i was working for apple um i had this little adapter right here where i could you know plug in my um computer and i could i have two screens so what i'm thinking is Maybe, follow me a little bit. Maybe I can use this to plug into my iPad and then plug my um, computer screen up to it. And I can be able to, you know, actually have like a full screen, like right dead in front of me. And I can use that as like a computer, which would be like really, really cool. Because. I have two two screens here, and I can't do honestly anything with them. So I'm thinking about trying that, and then if so, I'm gonna see if I can get a um, wireless keyboard and mouse, and then I can I can already have me a little MacBook right there. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, we're gonna test it out and see though. But um, I kind of wish that this had like more ports on it so that I could be able to plug in like the keyboard and um, you know, be able to use it that way because I didn't have a keyboard right here next to me. But um, yeah, we're gonna figure that all out. Um, I did make some chocolate cheese chocolate chip cookies because I was craving some and um, the first batch that I made they were good but I think I left them in a little bit too long so today I uh, made some more because I froze the back I mean the, yeah I froze the um the dough but then I let it melt and then I made four cookies for like about like maybe I didn't have a picture of them um I probably posted here here uh, they are so fizzy delicious. So, yeah. Um, I think that's about it. Um, right now I'm just catching up on um sweet magnolia, um, and washing because, like I said, I have to get up at like three o'clock in the morning and head out to work. I am here by myself i'll be here by myself pretty much all day today because um well right now i think it's like two something yeah 2 30 2 39 my mom actually had they have like some little picnic or something um at her job so she has to do a full 16 hour shift to help with um that so she doesn't get home to like i think maybe like 10 and that and something like that so she's gonna be going all day um so yeah typically i stay up to make sure that she is in which i probably might stay in i'm doing anyway even though i do have to get up like four hours later so we'll see how that though and i also have to 
uh, um, I have training and another outpatient thing on tomorrow. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to go or not. So I have to find out what I get to work. But I think I, we should be okay because the person that I typically work with, she's off tomorrow. Um, but she had like some stuff to handle with at the doctor. So she just got off tomorrow. So, um, yeah. Uh, if I can think of anything else, I'll let you guys know.